All right, another concept for you, taking the major scale or melodic minor scale or any scale you want and, and then basically playing... What I'm doing here is three notes from the scale and then I want to play the next three notes but I'm skipping the middle so I get like three notes, is the full notes just going up the scale and then I'm in G right now so I'm like... So I'm doing three notes, then the next three notes, but I skip the middle note. So I get kind of this five note pattern. Uh, I like to end it also with chromatic. That's, that's just, it, it, uh, you know, years of practicing and kind of you develop your own phrasing within a certain concept. So, so again, the basic approach is three notes, then two notes when I skip the middle, skip in the middle, then the next three notes in the scale fully and then the next three notes but skip in the middle so it's like three notes and another three notes but skip in the middle then back to the original three notes and then two notes because you skip the middle so it's like three two three two three two three two and again i really like doing chromatic at the end for some reason like you know and then you can do it down going down so so it's three notes, two notes, skip in the middle, three notes, two notes, skip in the middle, three notes, two notes, skip in the middle note. Okay? I'll do a little uh, chord progression for you. E minor 7 for four bars, C major 7 for four bars, B7 for four bars. Back to E minor 7 for four bars and try to improvise with that. So it's be like... Next chord, C major 7. Okay. And when I improvise and I practice, you know, I, I, I would practice mainly the concept, but I would add some other notes if I want to add some other notes or change my phrasing a little bit. So it's not just going up and down the scale, but I'm trying more to create, to take that main concept and put stuff around it to make it more musical.